my parents' 40th wedding anniversary, and we had a big wedding party for them. It was a surprise party, and uh, Mallory was uh, five at the time, just about five. Uh, there was music and dancing afterwards, and as Mallory was out on the parquet dance floor dancing and kind of flipping her hair this way and that way and being all dramatic at four or five years old, uh, my wife and I decided that, uh, or determined that, you know what, I think maybe she's got something for this, and so. That spring, uh, in May, um, my wife had come to me and said, hey, I found this North Atlanta Dance Academy. I'm going to enroll Mallory in uh, a spring event. It, it, 21 years later, here we are. It really does a lot to establish character. Um, there's a lot of uh, teamwork involved, there's a lot of instruction involved, um, there's a lot of um, being able to control one's body to stay physically fit. Uh, sometimes um, as a little girl they may not want to go but they feel like they need to go because their, their, their dance group needs them, they're part of that group. I think it's important um, as a young person to learn to develop that I'm part of a team, my team's counting on me, and I need to show up. And the interesting thing on all that is sometimes you don't feel like it or Mallory didn't feel like it, but once she got there and she was doing it, then the feelings came. So the important lesson there I think is you take actions and then the feelings come. But if you always wait for your feelings to get anything done, you probably won't be successful in anything. I've learned that it's important for the daughter to hear from the father that you're beautiful, that you're talented, that you're intelligent, that you're worthy. Um, they need to hear that. If she doesn't hear you're beautiful, you're talented, you're worthy from her father, then the opportunity exists where she can hear that from somebody else and be influenced by somebody else. And you, as a father, want to be the one that's influencing your daughter. have a favorite teacher in the first grade or the fifth grade or the ninth grade but that's for one year. Michael and Kitty Garrison have been involved with my daughter throughout most all of her life. The impact that comes down from a mentor that goes down to an individual over the over the continuum of their life is huge where you don't necessarily get that from a teacher. I was teased, Mr. Garrison, that uh, my wife and I taught Mallory to walk. Nada taught Mallory to dance, and which was just a liberation of her heart, of her passion. Mm -hmm.